where the mouth of the Pandore River empties into the Columbia south of Trail BC, sits the Juanita Dam. Juanita was opened in 1954 with four generator units and a capacity of 450 megawatts. In 2009, Fortis Incorporated, Columbia Power, and Columbia Basin Trust started the Juanita Expansion Project. This project will see the addition of a second powerhouse containing two Francis turbines that will produce a combined maximum output of 335 megawatts. Hydroelectric dams require massive quantities of concrete, and quality is absolutely critical. The Juanita expansion being no exception. At completion, it is estimated that 74,000 cubic meters of ready-mixed concrete will have been required. At Juanita, temperatures can vary from minus 20 Celsius in the winter into the blistering mid-30s in the summer. They needed a ready-mixed concrete supplier who has the skill and experience to provide quality product to a remote location under a variety of conditions. They chose Interroot Construction for this crucial supply. The Interroot team has worked conscientiously with the design-build contractor to provide the year-round production capacity, service, and delivery flexibility required to maintain the project schedules. Interroot Construction brought in a portable batch plant to a pit close to the job site. Since then, the project has moved forward and Interroot has placed a lot of concrete at Juanita. It is common in projects of this magnitude for the concrete to be evaluated by multiple independent sources for the owner, contractor, and the supplier. However, such redundant testing is both expensive and time-consuming. Working with the general contractor, Interroot has taken a different approach. Jerry McCaldoff, the quality control specialist hired by Interroot, takes concrete samples on site and performs all kinds of tests and analyses at the Interroot lab according to a detailed quality program. Interroot then shares all concrete test results with the owner and general contractor who review and audit the results and procedures. This process saves both time and money. Quality control manager Karen Eager, who supervises the job for SNC-Lavalin, is impressed with what Interroot has accomplished so far. The level of quality for the concrete supply has been very good to date. Uh, there's been a very low percentage of concrete rejected on the project, and this is due to the very stringent quality control programs that are implemented by Interroot. Interroot has also brought innovations like self-consolidating concrete, or SCC, to a new customer segment. At Juanita, SCC has been used to concrete in around the generator intake liners and other dense rebar structures where it is difficult to avoid air void. This new application has resulted in dramatic savings in time and cost to the project. Interroot teams and their partners continue their work at the Juanita job site. Work continues up on the intake. Work continues in the tunnels. When we consider the size of this endeavor, this project so far is a complete success for Interroot. Relations between Interroot and the client, the owner, and the other subcontractors are excellent. Juanita Expansion is well on track for its delivery date to the owners.